Hey everybody, I'm Steven21967 and we're in the infected. Today we're going to do the furnishing slash staging of the base, get everything put in place so it looks really nice and all set up and ready to go. And then I think that's probably going to be it for this video or for this series. We could start our next series and I'm not going to tell you right yet what we're going to do. We'll just, we'll, you'll have to wait another video and then we'll start that stuff. Come on, come here. Oh, oh! Wow, that's two. <laughs> he destroyed two of them real fast. <laughs> Sorry, we'll take him down. Take him down. Take him down. Let's no, let's just hit him. Yeah, let's just hit him with this. I'm gonna miss with the arrows, and I'm gonna have to go chase after them. <laughs> there we go. More nails, nice. Looks like I got a couple spike traps here left over. You just take them all the way over here and replace those two that just they just destroyed. There we go. We'll get that. And there we go. And then go get the other one. The bedroom is done. Using fire pots. Uh, trying to place the fish oil lamps upon the windows is kind of a hassle. I find that the only way to make them work is like put them right dead dead smack in the middle of the window. I'm putting that one there just because of the stairs. I don't want to put a fire pot there. This corner was a little dark. So yeah, we got the desk you can work on, a couple of um, couple cabinets so you can put your stuff in. You got a clothes rack over here, you got some summer clothes, or yeah, yeah, summer clothes. Somewhere we can sit if we want to kind of look over everything yep yep this is fine yep oh I better make this my spawn point I had when I was working over at my main base trying to get lead and and iron ore uh, I set the bed there to be my spawn point in case I died so I wouldn't end up back here and have to run all the way back over there while we were working on trying to get steel for the uh, for the fence posts <laughs> She just destroyed four spike traps. Holy smokes. I heard her scream, came out here, didn't think very much of it. Wow, those must have been all damaged. I guess I should have gone out there and repaired them. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. The hardcore base doesn't look so terribly hardcore. Bad, 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 bad. <sighs> Yeah, I guess we have to make more spike fences because <laughs> cause I didn't keep up on the repairs. I got so lazy there, man. All right, a couple more things um, in terms of upgrades. So here we have food prep table. We have the, the kitchen. Not much there. We got chemistry table. We have a loom over here. And over there is advanced workbench. We have some, we have a bird. We, we have a bird and we have uh, some tools here whole bunch whole bunch of bows because you're gonna need those and I got lots of arrows upstairs and then we kind of we have our stone grinder a brick forge an anvil and then a coal heater plus a bunch of uh, iron ore sand kind of stuff right here to do the, all the building and we've left some on the outside trying to leave this area open as much as possible so I don't run into things when there's uh, an emergency. And on the outside, um, those are all like empty boxes that can be used for building and, you know, I mean, carrying around materials. I just keep them there. There's no reason to have empty boxes inside. I just take advantage of, you know, the little, um, the deck area here. Actually, it's kind of like a porch, isn't it? Because it's covered. So, yeah, just take advantage of that right there. And... We don't we don't have a lot it's winter right now so um, we do have some fish that we did ice fishing but it's been it's very sparse man it's very sparse everything is dangerous so we are just barely hanging on and then over here is a is a kind of a lunchroom slash storage room there's not very much that we can do it's kind of a smaller space it, you know it's not set up with the living room dining room it doesn't have all those nice little amenities it's just what do we need here to you know 
to survive and some very simple fire pots outside to help light up the area actually the area that's really well lit up is the yard because clearly uh, with all the vambies that do come through uh, the dangers out there you know this is these are hardcore vambies we need to have lights outside as much as possible so we can see what's going on at night when we get a horde attack and everything and yeah we're gonna have to we we'll have to fix we we'll have to fix that uh, fence line over there super fast so well, not fence line but the spike traps get some stuff in place and start start filling it in because I think we're kind of near the end of this we don't we don't really need to do another hard night do we I don't I don't think so I don't I don't think we need to do one more so let me get this started on doing some repairs and then we'll we'll get some it's late we'll wrap things up tomorrow so there we go everything's done we've survived the horde we've survived uh like three horde attacks do we have two or three horde attacks i'm not sure and we also survived like hardcore vambies and predators one wolf okay one wolf got me but that was just because i was having a heck of a time trying trying to get this get the stupid greenhouse out of my hands that was i had too much too much was trying to move too much and that's how the wolf tagged me and got me in the end almost almost made it through so anyway um if you guys like this video i would appreciate a thumbs up subscribe hit the notification bell get alerts when i come out with new videos and as always comment and the next series is going to start tomorrow we're going to move to a new location and start building and we'll talk about what we're trying to do we'll, uh, a little bit of experiment trying to see what we can do i think we will uh, i can tell you we're going to be working with the roof the roof building material see what we can do with that to make interesting stuff not crazy stuff i i know what i want to build i'm not going to tell you until tomorrow and we'll see you guys in the next video. Later, dudes.